<laughs> anyway, we'll move on. Uh, joining us now, man, we often speak to from uh, Quintin Casuals uh, on, on a couple of subjects, actually, today. Chris Watney rejoins us. Good afternoon, Chris. Good afternoon, guys. Now, helping in these troubled times mm-hmm. financially are, are, are your good friends these days at uh, Corinthians over in Sao Paulo in Brazil. When we first started speaking, of course, you went and made that brilliant documentary where you went over and played uh, in Corinthian Stadium and your boys kind of played in front of about 35,000 people. So th- that th- that link has kind of been maintained. And we understand that uh, the new Corinthian's third kit, um, d- designed by Nike, carries your colours. Yeah, that's right. It's an amazing uh, compliment and, and tribute to us. But basically, you're absolutely right. The Corinthians Paulista in Brazil, who are the two-time world champions and sort of Brazil's Manchester United kind of club, they're launching a new kit to pay homage to us, the Corinthian casuals, the South London amateurs in Tolworth. And it's extraordinary. On Sunday... We had Nike come and do a photo shoot at the ground, and they were <laughs> they, they got Jamie Byatt, who's the star in the film Brothers and Football, with mm, him. I remember him. and they got him sort of posing, you know, modelling for the new campaign, which is going to come out in Brazil and 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 be this big shirt in Brazil. So, yeah, it's an amazing honour. But they, because we play in pink and brown, they were nervous about having the pink for sale in Brazil. It doesn't go down too well there for a football shirt. Right. And so they've made it brown and sky blue, which are also the colours on our shirt, but mm. they've dropped the pink to just the number on the back. <laughs> but um, it's quite extraordinary, really, that, that Nike would choose to do this. We're amazingly flattered. Yeah. So, so Jamie, a scaffolder from Tooting, will be on sort of billboards all over Sao Paulo, will he, with the third <laughs> kit? <laughs> exactly, exactly. It's, uh, it's quite extraordinary. And, and it's wonderful because Nike have offered us a percentage of the revenue that they make from the from the clothes. They've, they've done a whole range of, of Corinthian casuals related Brilliant. kits. And so we're going to make a percentage, which, again, during these times of COVID, it's an amazing boost for our finances to get a little bit of money come in from that. So, yeah, we're very thankful, but it's, it's wonderful timing, really. It's the 110-year anniversary of when our club formed the Corinthians Paul Eastern Sao Paulo, so they've done it in recognition of that. Lovely. Yeah, the film itself has been shown a lot, and the BT yeah, show a lot. Watch, yeah. it, it must have done done you quite a lot of favours, I would have thought. Yeah, I think so. I mean, yeah, the lifeblood of a club like Corinthian Casuals is the volunteers and the people in the local community who come down and want to be a part of it. And I think the, the greatest thing for the film, especially when it was on ITV as well uh, in November, it's just gone, and BT Sport did a brilliant job promoting it, was that it just opened the eyes to the local community of what's on their doorstep. Because I don't think a lot of people know that the club which essentially popularised football all around the world is in Tolworth. And, um, and so it's been great to get new blood in there and, and really get people to help out on the everyday duties. Brilliant. Look, good to talk to you as always. Yeah, thank you very much, guys. There we are. Chris Watney there from Corinthian Casuals. Never seen the film. It's well worth it. Yeah, the film is is excellent with them going over there, the team, and say the walking out, the boys walking out into the stadium in front of about 40,000 mad Brazilian football fans. Absolutely love the club. And they come over. People come come over over from San Paolo and and watch Corinthian Casuals games. They have a lot of pilgrimage, don't Mm. they? uh, Yeah, it's a cracking film. They get a chance. To see it, Brothers in Football is probably on YouTube, isn't it? But it certainly played a lot on, on BT Sport. Um, Hawksby and Jacobs here on Talk Sport and uh, we'll...